Did you get along with uh, the late, great New Jack? Unbelievably well. People don't even re- people probably don't even know that. Me and uh, Jack were extremely close. Like, uh, we would make sure every two weeks one of us would co- be calling the other to make sure we're cool. You know what I'm saying? And uh, it sucked that he passed away because I was with him the prior week. And then we got another gig in California. So the next week we were rolling on Thursday to go to California, LAX, man. East LA, we were going to do a signing, man. Great pay. And uh, the Thursday night, I think the night or two before we were leaving, he passed away, man, that morning. And uh, I was in shock. I was fucking pissed. Because I talked to him the night before and he was fine. So uh, we had a scramble, and Mustafa was in Northern California anyway, so he just flew down to L.A., and uh, they put him on again. Me and him did the signing, and we did it for Mustafa, for for New Jack, because he couldn't make it. So we still covered it, and, uh, yeah, it sucked losing up. He was a very good person. A lot of people don't realize uh, Jack was, you know, he was Jerome – And then he was New Jack. New Jack's a gimmick, man. People still don't understand that. You know what I'm saying? A gimmick's a gimmick. He'll still stab you in the ring because he's New Jack. But uh, I I used to get calls from a lot of people that were afraid to talk to him. I'm like, dude, it's it's a work. I mean, come on, man. Yeah, he's tough. He, He will fuck you up if you fucking do something stupid. But don't. Ask me to protect you. You know what I'm saying? Just talk to him like a man. You know, it's crazy. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it and click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews, match videos, or news updates. Follow us on Twitter at the Hannibal TV for instant updates.